Hey there all you YouTubers, this is Tony O with Tony O's Reviews and today, as promised, we're going to do the comparison on the SIG P365XL and the Springfield XD9. So, stay tuned, we'll take it right to the table. So, here we are at the tabletop. I just want to show that they're... <clears throat> Unloaded. I do have snap caps that we're going to use. We're going to do some trigger pull. Snap cap here. So, there's the width of them. You can see the XD9 is quite a bit wider than the 365XL. A um, little bit longer sight radius on the 365, a little bit longer barrel. Um, the XD9 has ambidextrous mag release, the 365 doesn't. 365 does kind of get caught up on the hand. So, I'm sure I can work around that. Trigger pull. Uh, this is a flat trigger. It pulls right at 90 degrees. Has a little bit of take up. And it's a nice firm pull. The XT9 has a lot of take up. It's a pretty easy pull, actually. I don't know what the weight, what the pound is on it, but um, I do like <clears throat> that this has safeties. There's a safety in the grip. Where if you're holding the, you have to be holding the grip and have your finger fully on the trigger. If you just get the trigger snagged on something, it won't fire. If you don't have a firm grip, putting it in your holster or something it won't fire I also like when it has one chambered I don't know if you can see that little that bump right there raises up you can feel it at night you can run your hand across it if it's dark and know you got one in the chamber and this little I think that's the back of the firing pin right there you can feel that and you can see it pretty well too. So that's the XD9. I like it. It's a good gun. It's hard to carry inside the waistband. Um, I carried it for a while, and it was just bulky. It's it's heavy. It's heavier than this one. It holds 10 rounds compared to 12 rounds. You can see how they fit in my hand. About the same except the grip on this one is just a lot smaller. See how my hand goes all the way around compared to this one? Big grip. Also comes with a 15 round, of that, a 15 round magazine that I have. You can get your hand on it a little better but it just makes it that much bigger and bulkier. It makes it easier to shoot. Um, I don't have the 15 round mag for this one they are 50 bucks and I just haven't um, haven't made that jump 12 rounds should be enough for anybody it would make it nice to be able to get my whole hand on it but carrying it every day uh, I probably want the shorter handle so that's the uh, that's the tabletop and we'll go back to the chair. So that was a review on the Sig Sauer 365 XL and the Springfield Armory XD9. Now Springfield Armory does have an XDS that they've came out with lately. That's an older gun. The XDS is a single stack. Um, holds close. I mean that only holds 10 rounds with a small clip in it. 
and the XDS, I believe. I mean, the, yeah, the XDS, I believe, holds maybe it's seven and one. So I, uh, it, it wasn't much thinner than the 365 XL. So I went ahead and got the XL. I mean, you got 12 rounds. That's more than any person should need. So <clears throat> that's the review as promised. And if you like my channel, subscribe to it. Hit the like button if you like the video. Hit the bell if you want to see when all my new videos come out. This is Tony O with Tony O's Reviews. Thanks for watching.